some sunglasses today so sunglasses are some of my guilty pleasure i just love sunglasses so much aside from protecting your eyes from the sun i just think that a good pair of sunglasses can add some statement into your outfit so no matter how casual or simple your outfit is if you're gonna pair it with a great pair of sunglasses it can add some sassiness into your look and some of my great pairs are from ravens i just love ravens so much um they have been so popular since 1937 and i just think that they are so classic so timeless so i can admit i have some ribbon addiction so i have a six pairs of ribbon and that's what i'm gonna talk to you about today so let's start with this one so if you're gonna buy some pair of ribbon sunglasses it comes with this case this is a faux leather case so it's not a genuine leather but just a faux leather case and you can see some logo right here and it says that a 100% uv protection ribbon right here and sunglasses by luxatica and when you're gonna open it it comes with this small paper so i haven't <laughs> remove it yet from its plastic and i don't read this um thing yeah and also with a cleaning cloth and then let's start with my um round metal rayman this is actually the rb3447 so you can you can actually see the model right here and also the size 50 21 you can also see the size at the back of the nose breech and it says here in the side made in italy so yes this raven round metal sunglasses are totally retro this look has been worn by legendary musicians and inspired by the 1960s counterculture when it's for this style first originated so this is an um, iconic sunglasses and known for their defined round crystal lenses and distinct shape so i love this ribbon it has a curve brober and adjustable nose pad and a thin metal temples with plastic end tips so yeah and i've just worn this ribbon like a few times i guess like three times yeah at the airport and i love to pair it with a black leather jacket so yes it kind of looks nice yeah so next this ribbon still comes with a black faux leather case so let's open this one this is my um blaze aviator so this is my Blaze Aviator sunglasses. So you can see the Ray-Ban um, Impress uh, logo right here. And yes, um, this is the model RB3584-M, 15311. And the size is 6113. And also it says right here on the side, made in Italy. I don't know if you can see it made in italy so yeah i just love this ribbon too so much it is a pilot shape and the free material is a block steel so yeah and a flat lens over frame construction for the first time ever in blaze series tanning gradient lenses so yeah i really love this one and this tough metal tones complete the look perfect for those pilots for the days rockstar by night so i guess the ravens back then are kind of like originally um made for pilots so yeah i just love this raven so much it's a little bit oversized but i love this size on me i don't think it's it's too big for me i just think it just looks great it looks perfect for its shape yeah So let's pick the next one. Yeah, let's open this up. This is my classic Ray-Ban sunglasses. Look at that. 
So it has a gold metal frame. And this one actually the RB3025 Aviator Large Metal with a size of 5840. It has an impressed um, print right here. It says um, Ray-Ban made in Italy and also right here. And it says right here it's polarized. So this is kind of like the polarized version. As you can see, it has a Ray-Ban here and there's a P on the tip. So that means it's polarized. This is more expensive than the regular Ray-Ban sunglasses. And this is the Aviator 1937, the original design. So this Aviator 1937 limited edition bears the original drop shape lens designed to fully cover the range of vision, nose pads, and temple tips, mother of pearl accents, and legendary crystal lenses. And this design is actually created back in the days to protect pilots' eyes from damaging sun rays. So, <laughs> yes, it actually has a green classic G15 lenses, but it doesn't look green at all. It looks like black to me. So yeah, I really love this sunglasses so much. It, it kind of looks some, you know, there's some elegance into it because of the um, gold frame. So yeah. So next, let's have this vintage sunglasses. Yes, this is a Ray vintage Ray-Ban sunglasses. This is the Ray-Ban W1265. Look at that. So beautiful. And you can see it's very durable. It's I think this this is more durable than the Ray-Ban nowadays. Yes, this is the Wayfarer Oval Max sunglasses. It has a more elongated variation of iconic Ray-Ban sunglasses. And it actually features a blonde uh, tortoise shell tap accents and Bosch and Lump RB3 mineral glass lenses. As you can see, aside from the logo, Raven logo right here, it has an impre impressed um, B and L. I don't know if you can see it from the video, but yeah. And also at the back of the gold plated nose bridge, it says B and L Raven USA. Yeah, this is really nice. This is by far the hardest to find and arguably the most eye-catching. And you can actually look for this design at the Vintage Designer Sunglasses shop. And this is of a very rare low production. So you are lucky if you can still find some. And I'm just so lucky because I got this sunglasses at a thrift shop for a very cheap price. Yes, um, I forgot how much was it, but I got this from a thrift, thrift shop in Germany. This one really looks so nice. I really love this Ray-Ban lot. So you can rock it with a white t-shirt and Levi's jeans. So yeah, I just love, um, you know, especially with guys because Ray-Bans are kind of like unisex sunglasses. When a guy wears some Ray-Ban and then pairs it with a white tee and a Levi, Levi's Trust jeans, oh my god, that just looks so hot. Yes. Okay, next, this one comes with a brown case. So yeah, I love this case. I love the brown case better than the black one. And this is my Ray-Ban beat sunglasses so yeah you can see the model right here on the side too it's the rb3594 and also the size is 5320 yes you can see also the size of the back of the nose bridge printed here my other ray-ban it states they're like made in italy this one there's no made in italy into it so yeah i don't know so i like this ray-ban too this um has a mirror lens technology and the frame it's a rubber gold on top and it has a gray gradient mirror lenses with a metal metal frame in oval shape so yeah this outstanding new model boast frames offset by rubberized metal accents so yeah I, and this is kind of like the list that i like in all of my pairs of ribbon sunglasses by this is the lightest so this is the most comfortable to wear you can almost not feel that you're wearing one because of how light it is 
So this is the most comfortable. It's so great when you pair it with just a t-shirt, like navy blue t-shirt. Yes, I love pairing this with a navy blue t-shirt. And also with this kind of color of shirt. So yeah. Hmm. This is a nice look at color. And next comes with a brown case too. So this is this is so beautiful. This is my favorite ever. This is my RB3025 and it is a size of 5814. This is my Raven Avator gradient sunglasses with a teardrop shaped lenses. And this is originally designed for US Avators. And it actually has a matte gold frame. So yeah, you can see it's matte. So I love it. I love it. It is a metal frame material with a brown gradient lenses. And this is actually my most worn pair ever. This is what I usually bring on the beach, on the swimming pools. So I remember once I almost lost it in the ocean when the waves hit me when I was in Chargao. Yeah, it's like swimming with this one. Just kidding. Okay. Aviator sunglasses design has become an icon. Yes, it also um, says right here on the side, made in Italy. So yeah, this is my favorite ever sunglasses. Hmm. So that's all of my sunglasses, guys. So please comment down below which is your favorite of all of my pairs. Yeah, yeah. if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. Because I'm going to do a lot of vlogs soon. So see you in my next vlog. Ciao!